What's up guys, Spin Firearms here, and these two firearms have been safety checked and cleared, um, and we are in the safety of my own home with my own firearms. Anyways, the Glock 26 for me, the reason I like it is the perfect size. It's not too big, it's not a double stack micro 9, it's just right. It's like perfect for literally everything. And so that is why I decided to get the CZ P10S. It has that same um, size roughly. It's a little thinner here and there. It's a little longer here and there, but roughly the same size and capacity, which I think is perfect um, for carry. Also stuff like the Smith & Wesson Shield Plus, that is in that same exact um, size that I really, really enjoy. Anyways, I was just going to break these down uh, for you today, um, show you what's similar about them, what's different. Anyways, when it comes to slide length and barrel length, as you can see, the CZ is going to be longer. The CZ is almost like one of those crossover pistols, like a Glock 26L. Not as long, but um, getting close to it. Anyways, you can see right there, it's about half an inch longer in the slide. Then when you come to capacity on the right, it's going to be um, 11 plus 1. And on the left, it's going to be 12 plus 1. So they're actually going to be pretty similar when it comes to capacity. And also, same with width. Although when you get down into the frame, the Glock 26 is going to be a little wider. But nonetheless, very similar. Um, I love the feel of both of them. They are different. I do like the Glock grip angle um, better than what CZ has going on here. But I do like the texturing of the CZ. I really like the trigger. I like the big trigger guard. I don't know if you guys can see really how big it is. But with that very small trigger, this is awesome for places like where I live, where in the winter we have a real winter. Um, I'm going to be wearing gloves. That is a huge thing to be able to get a glove finger in there. Also, check it out, rail. Also, great texturing here. Yeah, really excited to shoot this thing. Um, as you know, the Glock 26, it's going to be hard to replace. Um, but I could see myself carrying both. I mean, the Glock 26 is just, it's really hard for me to um, get away from. I've tried many times, but I always end up coming back to it. And I just think it's the perfect do-all firearm. And that's why I try to get as good as with this as possible because it's also my home defense. So, you know, I can transition smoothly and do my home defense, which I carry it with more rounds. But anyways, yeah, it's just a little breakdown in two firearms. Thanks for watching.